Hey guys, it's K7. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to play your favorite arcades using the MAME arcade emulator. It's pretty easy and very simple. And the only thing you'll have to do is follow this tutorial in order to find out how. So the first thing you're going to want to have and need is the emulator which you can find in the links down in the description. It's pretty easy to find just download it and then we can continue. Assuming that you have downloaded it already the only thing you will need to do is open it up like so. Okay when you open it up you'll get something like this you'll get a window like this and you'll see all of your games well you won't see them at first you'll have to put them into the ROMs folder you can find that within the directory folder of your emulator so what you want to do is you want to go to the folder and then open it and look for the ROMs folder and there you will find all your ROMs that you've downloaded you will have to download any arcade ROM separately from this one you can search on the internet to find ROMs and games for arcades and stuff like that so you can search but this tutorial is just for showing you how to set up the arcade simulator and etc so once you found a main arcade ROM once you've downloaded that from the internet somewhere you need to go to the ROMs folder so you'll just open it up like so and put it in here so as you can see in this folder I have all my ROMs located and what you saw when I opened the main main client was all the games that I have registered and available to play so you just put them there and then load up your main arcade emulator once you've placed your ROMs or games that you want to play into the ROM folder then you want to audit the game so that the emulator can check to see if the game works or not so you're gonna left click on tools and then you're gonna click on audit all games and what that'll do is audit the games and get them working for you and you want to do this every time you add a new game to your list so you go to the tools and then audit them and I'll just do it just to show you how it works and as you can see it'll start the auditing process and this audits all of the games that you have in your ROM folder once it finishes then you can start up any game that you already have within that folder that is if it works this will let you know if it works or not sometimes it indicates yellow or red but sometimes it doesn't necessarily mean that the ROM doesn't work just because it's yellow or red but green usually means a-okay if it's yellow or red or something sometimes it's just something that the audit isn't reading or the emulator isn't reading but that doesn't necessarily mean that the ROM is broken keep that in mind okay so once you finish your audit you then want to select the game and load it up so here we can see that I've loaded up Miss Pac-Man the first thing you want to do because the game won't have any control set to it it'll have the original arcade control set to the original control so the first thing you want to do is set some controls to your game and any controller that you have hooked up into your PC it will recognize so the only thing you have to do is set the controls to fit however your gameplay style benefits you the only thing you have to do to set up the controls is you hit the tab button and then uh, you select input this machine like so so as you can see I've already set some controls here and this is the layout that I have right now and it works for me now in order to set the controls I would suggest that you double click on it you double click on it and then you hit escape and delete all the previous files first or control sets it'll say none like you see 
a little bit on the bottom you see a little list that says none you double click on it and then you hit escape and do that for everything and clear out the entire thing first and then start putting in your inputs once you put your inputs in you double click again and then you hold whatever button that you want to insert and then it'll register that once you're finished you leave out and it'll save your settings forever you never have to set them again you only have to set them once so keep that in mind too so you don't have to go in and have to change it each and every time so you just go back and then you'll be able to play You've got to love a classic game of Miss Pac-Man. Hey, I think anyone does. Eating my way to victory. And there you go it works perfectly and as you can see that was the arcade version of Ms. Pac-Man you just hit whatever button you've input for the coin and then you press start to play and then you set your buttons anyways that just about does it for this video I hope you guys have enjoyed it if you have any questions leave your thoughts down below in the comment section also if this video was helpful to you, make sure to leave a like if you liked the video. And also, if you didn't like the video, you could leave a thumbs down. But, anyways, that'll be all for now. I hope you guys enjoy playing your new arcade games on the main emulator. Take care, guys. Until next time, this has been K7. Peace. Later.